self-imposed vacuum because we spend all day, day after day after day, in a writer's room, just the 10 of us. Um, and sometimes we're, it, it's really nice to be reminded who we're doing this for and that people appreciate it. So thank you very much. Manny, your final thoughts about saying goodbye. Well, I just want to uh, say thank you. I've worked on numerous shows, and, and I just want to say this, the, the cast, the actors on this show, from Michael on down, are not only talented, but they're the sweetest, nicest, most wonderful people I've ever worked with as a writer. Just the most generous, wonderful group. And, and as great as they look on stage, they really are great people. And I want to thank them all for just, just a wonderful many years on deck. Thank you. Why? Your thoughts Well, I was showing pictures backstage that my, my daughter was eight years old when I started the show, and she's now 16. And just the, the passage of time has been um, remarkable and humbling to be part of this. I remember the first time we came to Comic Con, Sarah, so you remember, Michael, this, we were in uh, this little room, and uh, yeah. now we're in the room that Iron Man gets, and that, that <laughs> Dark Knight Rises. Just, um, just extraordinary, and thank you, everybody. Amy? Well, this is actually my first Comic-Con panel, so I called David, and I said, you know, what, what should I expect? And he said, just take it in and never forget it. And so I want you guys to know that my heart is racing so fast right now, and I'm looking at all of you guys, and your enthusiasm is so contagious. And I will never, ever, ever forget this for as long as my, I live. And I want to thank you for that gift. Desmond, uh, Yeah, honestly, um, I thank you all. Um, and look, the deal is, if you guys don't watch the show, the show's not on the air. So you watch the show. <laughs> thank you very much. Well, you know, you know, one of the reasons why I became an actor was because I'm, I'm so attracted to camaraderie. And everybody on this panel, everybody, all the crew, everybody that worked on this show, we've created such a special bond that I will never, ever forget. But what I learned about this show is that that camaraderie extended to you amazing fans. And whenever I speak to any one of you out there about this show, it feels like, you know, a camaraderie that, that's very special. And that bond is just as strong. So I thank you from the bottom of my heart for being such great fans and supporting us throughout these eight years. Thank you so much. First of all, I still sort of feel like the baby of the group, um, and I feel really, really, really blessed to be a part of this group, and I want to thank everyone for welcoming me into this show, both all of you guys out there and all of you guys sitting at this panel, and I am extremely inspired by this extraordinary cast, and I've had the pleasure of working, especially with uh, both Jennifer and Michael, you guys blow me away every single day. You have been my inspiration every day of working on the show. Thank you guys as well. Lauren, your thoughts? Um, I just think it's really extraordinary to end this whole cycle here. <laughs> and thanks. Thank you. Two years on the show, you guys have kept me alive for the last six years. <laughs> sincerely, sincerely. Whether I'm in the Costco or on an escalator, you always remind me and you always want me to say the thing that I can't say. Don't say it. But I just want to tell you, aside from the <laughs> Soprano. I just want to say, you know, the opportunity to work with these actors and these producers and to have this experience has been amazing, but to just walk out and be embraced by you guys is, is the icing on the cake. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Julie? Well, 
um, like Clyde, I remember coming here when we were in just some tiny room somewhere tucked away, and to be here today and see how the, uh, you guys have just grown so much um, is just tremendous. And to be a part of a show where the fans are as passionate about it as we are making it, uh, nothing beats that as an actor. So thank you. Well, I think we spent a lot of time with the show making what is artificial feel real. Artificial characters, artificial scenarios. And certainly that our relationships with each other are authentic. But the most authentic thing about this show is our relationship to you. You're the reason we show up every day. We want to do right by you because your standards are high and you deserve good work. So it can't be a wrap until we're all here together. Like, especially the people that waited to be in this room. Like, it's a wrap with you all now. You know, Dexter came out at a time that coincided with Comic-Con being a place that attracted more than just strictly comic book fans, but fans of uh, shows like Dexter, and we wouldn't be here now if it weren't for that fact. And just as you all waited in line and are here for us, we have been here for you, and we are here because of you, and we all thank you so much. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, let's hear...